Hello everybody. I am doing something very unusual for a change and I thought maybe uh, you would like to see some of the things that I got when I went to the onstage event for Stampin' Up. Um, I had a wonderful time and I just wanted to share it with you and I thought you might like to see these things. Um, I'm just going to start with the pillow gifts that I got from a couple of my roommates. This one is a darling little um, box made by Janelle. And let's see what she's put inside. She has got it filled, oh, with some yummy candy. Look at that, she is very generous. Can't wait to dig into those. But isn't that a cute little container? That's darling. Okay, so my other pillow gift is from um, another teammate named Inez. And she loves to make these slimline notebooks, but look at that little Scotty dog. He's so adorable. And she made that for each of us who were in her room. So when we got to um, Indianapolis, we went to um, sign into our motel and get our room acclimated. But then Inez and I were um, invited to go to the center stage event, which is for Silver Elite and above. And uh, we got there and I wanted to show you what they gave each of us. Now this is something that everybody um, is gonna get. So here is your new celebration catalog. I can only show you the cover. And then here is our new January to April mini. I'll tell you more about that later, but of course I can show you the cover. I can't show you what's inside yet. Uh, one of the papers that were in our little box is um, about Paper Pumpkin. If you're a Paper Pumpkin subscriber, um, this is something that you can um, order. These are, let's see, four, four of each. So you get 16 full-size cards and envelopes for only $10. This is an add-on. So you can get that if you are a Paper Pumpkin subscriber, and that's an add-on for your December kit. Everybody gets a, a beautiful lanyard. They give you some fun little pins to put on there. I got the cute bunny. And, uh, and then we get these tags. So this uh, tells us all the different things that we earned. Um, I was uh, level two. So level one is the lowest and that's in the pink. Level two is the next and it goes up to level four. So we got a free stamp set in our box and another free stamp set in our box. This one is in the celebration and you can get that for free with a hundred dollar purchase from January 5 through um, February 28th. Now our swag bag this year is this beautiful coat. It's like a faux leather. It's really nice. So soft. And it's got the magnetic closing, just one pocket with a zipper in there, but then it's got a pocket back here. And they gave us a lovely notebook. I guess this is the front because it's got the little logo down there. Look at the sides, isn't that cute? And then we got a lovely ink pen. Let's see if I can find that ink pen. Here it is. Look at that cute ink pen, it's all in. I'm wondering if this might be one of the new colors that might be coming out. I'm not sure. But anyway, so back to the swag bag. This is gonna be available to purchase. And um, for, oh, let's see, what do they say? It's on our logo site. So we can purchase these extra, even though, even if you didn't go to on stage. But if you're not uh, a demonstrator and this bag is very intriguing to you, um, I am going to be doing a drawing. So anybody who watches this video and makes a comment, um, that I'm gonna put your name in a drawing and somebody is gonna win one of these nice swag bags. Okay, um, on Saturday morning, we got up bright and early and we went and we did some swapping before the event. So first I'm gonna show you some of the 3D projects that um, I received. Now, I did not bring one of my 3D projects to show you what I brought. Okay, this is called a diaper fold. 
and she's got a little English tea time in there. I think this one is from, oh no, this is from Nadine Stolt. Oh, I met Nadine um, at our Friday night event. I'll tell you more about that in a little bit. And this, I haven't even opened this one yet. This is, uh, I don't know, on stage swap. Her name is Diane Warning from Wisconsin. It is a two pocket fun fold tea boutique designer paper. So it's a, it's a fun fold. I guess you could put um, like a little tea bag in there as well, like that. That's cute. And she's got a little teacup in there. That's really cute. It says, what does it say on there? Relax, that's what you do when you have a cup of tea, right? put that back in there so I can remember who made that. Okay, this one is from Engineer Spouse. Okay, here it is, Maureen White. Maureen White, I um, swapped with her. And this is a little gift card holder. So you just gotta slide your ribbon down a little bit, I guess. It's, it's really cute, it says candy cane, wishes and mistletoe kisses that's cute and then it's it's a little gift card holder cute keep that together this one i thought was very um clever this one is by melinda hutchinson and it's got a sucker there and it says sweet winter wishes and let's see, it's a hot chocolate flavored sucker. Isn't that cute? And then the little cups from, she told me it's from the Nothing Better Than Sweet, her collection. This one is from Lynn Brinker. It's like a, um, like a coaster, like a chipboard. And she covered it with some of our beautiful paper and then she put a calendar on there. It says, fa -la -la. that's so cute. This one is a little note, a three inch by one and a quarter inch, or three inch by one and a half inch maybe. The post-it notes, those are perfect for when you're doing die cuts on your machine. And another one over here on the show first. This was the first one that I got from someone when we were at the motel. She didn't even wait. So it says, uh, to friends far and near, and she was so excited to share it. Um, it's got this little mini candy. I think it's more like a cookie. And that fits right in there, but it's a really clever little box. Um, D. Pulasic from Illinois. So then you just tuck this into the belly band. That's a cute little box. Um, I, share, I swapped with two different ladies who made the exact same thing, but I know they were two different people. Um, oh, the ribbon came off this one, so let's just check to see. I believe it's a Kit Kat. Yep, it holds one of these um, little Kit Kat candy bars in there. I love Kit Kat, but those are so cute, and you can buy this die. It's called the Cracker Die, I think. I can't remember, I don't have my catalog with me. But isn't that cute? But I don't have the names of the ladies who I got those from. I also don't have a name for who gave me this one. And she had just huge 3D swaps. My 3D swap was not that big. Um, but she didn't have her name on here. But it's this cute little purse. And uh, she had four of these Kit Kats in there. Four of them. I mean, very, very generous. Um, there's only two in there now because, you know, I already told you I love Kit Kat. So I snacked a little bit. Now that was Saturday morning before the event. And I'm just going to grab some other cards here. I'm going to backtrack just a little bit. And whoop, uh, let's see, the, myself and my three roommates participated in a a shoebox swap on Friday night with Stephanie Flath from right here from Wyoming, Michigan. 
and there was 23 of us that participated in that swap. And so, uh, well, I'll just show you. This is the this is the card that I made, and I used that same calendar that. Um, let's see, what's her name again? Lynn used on hers. They're very, they're very fun. Everybody seemed to really enjoy that. And I used the Hues of Happiness designer paper. And yes, I did fussy cut all those flowers out. Um, and I did it for everybody. Okay, so this card, so pretty. Um, Sending Smiles is the stamp set. Let's see who made that. She doesn't have her name in there. Okay, so I don't know who made this one, but look how cute this is. It's a little window, and then your flower stays on the inside. It says, sending sunshine to brighten your day. Very, very cute. This one is using the, okay, Sweet Songbird stamp set. Let's see who made that one. And she doesn't have her name in there either. So this is, she just put some music notes on the inside. This is from uh, Waves of the Ocean uh, by Cindy Pratt. Where's she from? She is Silver Elite from Lapeer, Michigan. I love that, that's a great masculine card too. Well, this one was made by my roommate, Inez. Inez is on my second level on my team. And uh, she used the Soft Seedling stamp set. Um, let's see, that is Soft Seafoam paper on some Blackberry Bliss. And then I'm gonna show you another one that's so, so similar and yet so, so different. And that's made by my other roommate, which is um, Janelle Anderson. Janelle is also on my second level, but we had a wonderful time and we are wonderful friends, each and every one of us. Let's see if she, I know she put something on the inside of hers. Nope, she didn't, I thought she did. But isn't that pretty? That's so pretty. I love that and I, I love, I love this. And this is, these are the, oh, I'm drawing a brain freeze, but the two dies that come in this set, one has these squares and rectangles, and one has this floral. So, oh, I know, it's called split card dies. All right, here I got two of them. Yeah, I sure do. Two of them that were made with, hmm, well, I'll find it. This is the, this is the Aspen die. Everybody wants the Aspen die, and I, guess I got some good news for you because the Aspen die is carried over. It's not going to be retired after the mini is done. So this is a wonderful sympathy card, and this was made by, I don't know. We were all supposed to put our name in these so that we would know who to give credit to, but she didn't put her name in there either, but I love it. This one is very special to me because I met this wonderful gal at the event, and her name is Nancy. So let's see, where is Nancy from if she put her information in here? Yep, there it is, Nancy Olson. And it's a wonderful uh, fall themed card. And Nancy was wearing a sweatshirt that said Faith Over Fear. And so because I am a believer in Jesus Christ, I said, oh, how I love your, your shirt. And she said, oh, but I wear it because we just found out that my husband is in remission and he was in head cancer for a couple years. So I was really excited to get to know this wonderful lady and to share a little bit with her that night. Here we have a Christmas card. Oh, the ribbons over top of it says Silent Night, Holy Night. Oh, and her name is not on the outside. Let's see if she put it on the inside. All right. Her name is Bev, M-A-M-A-Y-E-K. And I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. But look how shiny and pretty that is. 
Now this one is a box card. I'm gonna, her name is Karen Whipperman. But check this out. You open it up like this. In your box, I gotta get it to stand up straight. I think I folded my gnomes. Isn't that cute? That's really cute. Several of the ladies use the gnomes. Let's find another gnome card. This one is by Sherry Moore. Where's Sherry from? Sherry is from, I don't know, it doesn't say, but that's a cute one. And another gnome card. This one is by Tracy Tomes, T-H-O-M-E-S. And it doesn't say where she's from either. Okay. This is a cute one that was made by my friend Anna. She also shared our room. Anna Seitzma, she is in my second level as well. And she chose to use the party puppins. And she did a lot of work ahead of time to prepare this for the ladies. And um, whoop, there's just her name. She's here from Grand Rapids, Michigan. Another gnome card. Oh. They didn't put their name on the back. Let me double check, see who made this one. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. These gnomes are very, very popular. And this gal did not tell me who made that one either. This one is very pretty. Kind of backtracking to the soft seedling stamp set. Isn't that pretty for fall? And her name is Catherine... Toning Popovich from Fruitport, Michigan. Very pretty. Uh, okay, so here we got another Christmas card by Christy Hicks. Sorry, Christy Hicks Widerman. Very pretty. You see that one? Love that. And this one, it's very soft. It's got some vellum behind the flower. And so she had to do all this extra cutting. We had no cutting machines. The only thing we did would be to stamp and assemble. So anything that needed to be cut ahead of time, she did all that ahead of time. So I appreciate that. I don't know who did that one. Oh, this one's so cute. Look at that cute little corgi. Uh, Jamie Sales from LaPorte, Indiana. And that's really cute. It's just a fun, it says, uh, growing older is mandatory, growing up is optional. And I like how she highlighted the mandatory and the optional. I just want to say thank you to my hubby who is videoing this for me and he's getting sleepy, so he's yawning a little bit if you hear him. Um, oh, here's our cute little panda bear, lazy on a branch. Let's see who made that one. That one is made by Donna Knoll from Michigan City, Indiana. Very cute. This is a stamp set that I do not own. I can't even remember what it's called. Uh, May Your Heart Begin to Heal. This is Stephanie Flask's card. I didn't even realize that. Um, I did not make any of the cards besides my own because I went to the event on Friday night, so um, each of the ladies needed to make, I think, 11 cards up completely. But if we were going to the event at night, we had to make all 23 of those cards up ourselves. So I got to have one of, that were already made, but that's beautiful, Stephanie. Oh, and I loved this one too. Who's this one made by? Look how pretty that is. I love those color tones. Oh, she didn't tell me her name either. This one is use the Splendid Day cards uh, stamp set, and it's by Ms. Georgianne Everhart. You see that? That's pretty, real soft colors. One more card and then we will um, call it quits for tonight and then we'll start up again another day. Uh, this is the cute little um, ladybugs. And that was made by Nadine Stolt. 
And I saw another one by Nadine earlier, but I'm not gonna dig for that. So thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you comment, remember, I'm gonna pick up the, the swag bag that we got and fell on the floor. But that will be, if you make a comment, then I will put your name in a drawing and you can win that swag bag for yourself. I will see you again another time. Have a good night.